What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have a brand new product review. This is 2021 Panini Chronicles Basketball, a set that I'm really a big fan of and excited to get into here today. So real quick, we have a giveaway going on. You can win a rookie card of one of the top breakout stars in the NBA. All you gotta do to enter is like the video, subscribe to the channel, and then in the description, there's a video link. That's the giveaway video. Now go to that one and comment the player in the NBA who's impressed you the most so far this season, and you are entered. All the rules and information down below. And as always, guys, help us out by dropping a like, subscribing, share, and comment, and um, also ring the notification bell. Be notified every time we post. Also, uh, memberships are available. You can get bonus videos, badges, emojis, and all that really helps us out. Join button next to the subscribe button and a uh, link in the description. So yeah, here we go. Chronicles Basketball. I like this one a lot. And it is very late into uh, this collecting year. It's already the next year, but I was really looking forward to this one. And hopefully it's as good as I remember it from last year. It was a really good set in my opinion. So here's the information for this product. The SRP for this one is 250, so increased from last year. Our resale is, is about like 330, give or take 10, 20 bucks. So, I mean, uh, not too much over that uh, SRP, but still you know, decently expensive compared to other 2021 products. It's a little bit um, cheaper than uh, a bunch of the other ones. So you get, Eight cards per pack, six packs per box, two autographs per box. These come in 12 box cases. So this features the top rookies and stars. It's very rookie heavy. And uh, one knock on it is that you get so many rookies that they're not worth anything. My kind of thought process is if someone's good, you want their cards. So um, you know, even if you know they're maybe worth less, having a, a bunch of those guys is uh, really nice in my opinion. So um, 20 plus sets. Here you go. 20 plus sets make up the uh, product here. Unused sets. So... Yeah, we had Prism and we had maybe uh, Crown Royale. They're not going to be in here except for maybe an update version. Um, but the sets that weren't used in regular products are in here. So those that those uh, kind of comprise this uh, set here. Look for many sets, and I'm going to show you the back. So many things here to find in this product. Like a lot of products will have a lot of base cards. This one will have base cards, but each one is like much better than a regular base card. They're like rookie cards or a different set. So some sets include Optic Traded. So if a player's been traded, they update their Optic card. They have uh, Gala, which is ultra rare, number to eight. Look out for that one. Gold Standard and Titanium. Uh, those are also uh, short prints or low number cards to look for. And there's Limited, Majestic, Plates and Patches, uh, Prism Update. Same thing with Optic, but with Prism, uh, but updated ones. Then there's Luminance, rookie, a uh, rated rookie for new players who haven't gotten one. Crusade, Honors, Phoenix, things like that. Autographs include Hometown uh, Heroes, Cornerstones, which is personally my favorite from this one. Uh, there's also Phoenix. Uh, there's the Prism National Pride, which is a new one, so look out for that. I think Luca signs for that one, as well as many other international players. Uh, Rookies and Stars Airborne, playoff, uh, Hall of Fame, and Gold Standard, stuff like that. So look out for one of one Platinum Parallels, and there's also Retail in Asia. So that's all the product information. Uh, now part two of our review here would be opening the box. A lot of information for that, and it's just a, it's a busy set, a lot going on, a lot to look for, not like other sets. So let's get into this box now and see what we have find two autographs so you got a bunch of guys on the front so you're not going to get you know a base card of rodney hood it's all stars or or rookies in this stuff and a lot of the kind of lower rookie names are not in here you might still find some but mainly the top guys you'll find so i always like this one a lot and let's get to the first pack see what we got going on here very excited to see uh what this year's looks like so thoughts on chronicles do you like it do you not like it is it one you get for yourself? Is it not? And here we go. A lot of stuff coming soon, so stay tuned. A lot of new products. So many products after like almost a two-month break are going to release, so stay tuned. We'll have them all here to review for you guys. So here's the actual base chronicles. So this is the um, kind of standard one. And there you go. We have threads there for Tail Maladon. And yeah, so this all, all, every single card in here is gonna be different, pretty much. The best way to put it. They're all different sets. Um yeah, so there we go. And next one up, Pressure to Chua. This is Panini. So the base Panini set. As always, guys, once again, help us out by dropping a like, subscribing, and uh, sharing, and commenting, and sign up for membership if interested. That is the, the Panini one. Then we have Pokashevsky. This is Luminance. They'll have that kind of glossy one this year. So I like that rookie logo. And then Crusade Zion. This is this year's Crusade. Hmm. This is always one of my more favorite ones. Not a huge fan of this year's Crusade design, to be honest. I think it looks okay at best. So, yeah, there we go. Zion uh, Crusade. Put that there. Kyrie Honors. That's a new one. That was a football set. So you'll see so many sets that weren't used. And all those sets, once again, comprise uh, to make this one. And then they have the base chronicles. But you'll see so many sets that you might see from baseball or maybe an older release. 
that hasn't been used in a while, but Kyrie Honors and Denny Avdia. And then there's a Vassell there. There we are. This is Essentials. This is this year's Essentials, actually. I didn't know what this was when I first saw it. E, it's Essentials. So they changed this a lot. This used to have a much different design. If you remember last year's Essentials, this looks nothing like it. I saw it on a preview and had no clue what it was until now. So Denny Avdia, interesting. All right. One pack down. So as you see, we got Rookies and Stars. That's pretty much... Maybe this should be called Rookies and Stars and not Chronicles. But next one up. There's the base, so other than this like front base card, everything will be a different different card. So it's not like your regular product there. We have Prestige, Patrick Williams. And I think we, we didn't get any number cards there, did we? We usually get one. Maybe I missed one. Uh, we'll take a look in a second. Patrick Williams. Got Jason Tate, Panini. And got a Zion. So we got a bunch of Zion so far. To a 99. Hopefully he's back in the court soon. Love Zion to a 99.18. This is the playbook one. So not a fan of the playbook base personally. It's a football set and known for being a booklet cards, right? Crazy memorabilia. And these are just little base cards. So I don't know why you know, they don't do too much with these, but cool Zion numbered card. I'll give him a sleeve in a second. James Wiseman honors. I actually really like the honors the most. These might be my favorite ones from this year's Chronicles. And uh, that's a beautiful card. So honors, one of the best products that they make for cards, period, in my opinion. I think it's one of the, easily one of the best sets. There's Manuel Quickly. Got Zion again. So you'll get a lot of top guys. And James Wiseman. So you guys know, you're in the right place. James Wiseman to uh, 149. So it's always a dub to get some uh, top rookies. And you, do, you definitely have your uh, chance of getting those. So let's leave up these two guys too. So already we have two Zions, the three Zions, two Wisemans, one numbered, one Chrome. And I don't think we got a number card from that first one, did we? Or maybe we got a parallel. Let's take a quick look. Some of these can be a little sneaky, but um, I think no. Yeah, I think, I think no. All right, well, let's keep going. Still looking for our two autos. Last year I pulled uh, that Zion actually in the back from Chronicles. Now Flux has his own release and there's a Jaren from the year before. Pac-Man cards of the IG in the back. Check it out. Posted tons of stuff. Looks at upcoming products. Things like that. Exclusive info, early news. All that good stuff. We have a thick card here. Maybe a hit. We will see. We got a uh, Jokic. And uh, Nuggets are losing players left and right. Prestige. Abdia. Got a uh, Cade Cunningham. Now we got Sadiq Bay. We won't see Cade for a while. It'll be a little bit of time. They have, they're behind. And they refuse to uh, catch up. Sadiq Bay playbook. Halliburton to 25. Oh, all right. How about that? I like that. So this is a uh, limited. Another football set. So that is a pretty uh, pretty cool one there. 11 to 25. I will take that. And it's the purple. Matches nicely. I really like that one. I really like that one a lot. That's a really good one. We'll sleeve it in a sec. Wiseman, of course. I think we have a hit here. So I just want to get to this hit first. Uh, let's see. What is this? I'm not too sure. Here, let's see this in a second. James Wiseman. So here's a gold standard auto of a Chua. Not on card. I have a Jaren one that is on card because they used to make them on card. Now everything's thicker in these, but to 99, a uh, Chua. One off. That's six. Yeah, that's six. Now I know the base are limited. I don't think these ones are. And uh, not associated. Yeah, so the base ones, the base rookies are more rare. Those ones I think are just number 299. Desmond Bain, my guy. And the Mellow Ball Essentials. That looks real nice. Ooh, ooh, ooh. If I compare that with the Avdia. So definitely take a look at these cards. You have, you'll get a lot of stuff worth looking at here. Yeah, so there's... Alright, just making sure that wasn't like a, a hollow or anything like that. Or like a silver of some sort. That's nice. I like this one a lot. Saw it in the preview. Didn't know what I was looking at, but now I know. Sleeve up a Mellow. So there's lots to collect. It's almost like collecting this whole entire set would be one crazy task because there's so many things to find. But I, I think it looks nice. One thing I just will say about it is that I feel like you get all those sets, but it's kind of like a little, little bit, 
not in the worst way, but a little dumbed down set of some of these sets. Like you, you'll see the uh, gold standard RPAs don't really stand up as much to the actual product ones. And the luminance, which is kind of like a glossy um, design, isn't as crazy as football luminance, something like that. But still nice. All right, let's keep going. Got Ben Simmons. So those parallels also exist for the chrome ones too. So you get like a really nice one of one gold, something like that. You can get those for the chrome sets, which looks beautiful. Obi we'll Toppin, uh, threads. There's the luminance, Killian Hayes. So like if you've seen another uh, luminance card, maybe from football, it's just like not, not exactly there, but it's, it's for the most part there. Donovan Mitchell plates and patches to 249, another uh, football one there. Oh, and there we go. Says the Mitchell. Here's a pretty cool one. Moses Brown's Prism Rookie. So you can get his whole entire line of Prism cards. There we go. Moses Brown got his Prism Rookie. Congratulations. And it's a real picture of him. That's pretty cool. I like that. So a nice little card to chase there. Oh, and yay. The one I've been waiting for. Jalen Noel. Jalen uh, Yesel to 149. All right. Well, that was the, uh, the one we've been hoping for and we finally got it cole anthony that's a good one there's a uh, killian hayes i think these look like some of the best ones doesn't fit the essentials kind of brand but i'm not gonna complain i think it looks uh pretty good not gonna lie all right let's uh sleeve up this one and that that moses is a pretty cool card two packs left so as you can see it's a busy set a lot going on a lot of different sets but i think it's a really nice set overall one of my favorites and I think it provides really good value at 330 compared to some of the other products out there. I don't think it's too bad personally. Wiseman, Halliburton, and we, now we just need Ant right here. Donovan Mitchell. Got a lot of Donovan, a lot of Zion, Wiseman. Oh, you know what? Got Desmond Bain, baby. Let's go. Look at him in the back. Sneaking in that Donovan Mitchell card. As far as I'm concerned, that's a Desmond Bain rookie. Patrick Williams. Hometown Heroes has a chrome set there. Pretty cool one. Oh, and there's a Crusade. Luka Doncic. We've been getting our fair share of numbered Lukas recently. Crusade. We can get 77. We can get a 107. All right. He's a one-of-a-kind player, and he likes the number seven. Pretty cool. Pretty cool, Luka. Sadiq Bey and Giannis. So, last pack so far. Really fun opening. I mean, our base stack, that's our base. This is our highlights. That's everything else. The base stack is so small. So if you open any other box, your base stack will be up to here. 90% of the cards you don't look twice at. This one, every card you want to stop and take a look at because you never know what you got. We have a filler in here. Okay, we have fillers in here. Russell Westbrook. Got some Russell Westbrook. Lakers Savior. And we got ourselves an Isaac Okoro Panini. This actually just looks like luminance, honestly. This year's luminance in this pro pro product. I really can't tell the difference. Almost. Got a LeBron James. Can we get Isaiah Stewart next? No. We got 33 of 49. 3 plus 3 is 6. Which is a jersey number now. Got Denny. Crusade. Oh. Oh, wait. All right, let's look at that one. Last. The cell. Put that down. That might be a numbered honors, which is one that I was really hoping to get. Jada McDaniels. And the final one. Got a Zion. Is it number? Oh, it might just be a silver. A silver Zion uh, honors. I like this one a lot. This is one of my favorite sets. So much Zion in this box. Not a bad thing at all, but there we go. That does it for a Chronicles box. A set that I'm a huge fan of. Like it a lot. Let's uh, look through what we got. See if it was good. If it was bad. What you like, what you don't like. And we'll give our final thoughts and rating for this product here. So as you can see, pretty much every single card is you know, worthy of a highlight or looking at. And there's really cool stuff overall. So tons of rookies from many different sets. 20 plus sets once again. Essentials is a whole new thing now. Got Playbook. Got some Luminance. Crusade. Zion. So all the uh, top vets and as well as the, uh, the rookies that are you know, worth noting. Then we got Zion Honors, got LeBron to thir uh, 33 of 49, Luka numbered, so our number cards actually were pretty good to us, Patrick Williams, 
Desmond Bain to 149, and Donovan somehow. This must be really off-centered. Uh, Patri uh, not Patrick Williams, Tyrese Halliburton, uh, James Wiseman, um, Yassel, Moses Brown, Prism Rookie. He finally got his. It's a shame Lou Dort didn't get one last year. Uh, it's 249, Mitchell, Desmond Bain. Yeah, it's funny they're back-to-back. -back. Lamelo Ball, Essentials, I think it looks real good. Halliburton to 25, purple. Matches really nicely. Wiseman, Chua, Wiseman Honors, Zion numbered to 99. Wiseman to 149, and Zion again. Here is our final hand. Pretty uh, big final hand, but a lot of nice stuff. So, what were your thoughts? Did you like what you saw? Was it uh, something you would want to get for yourself? Something you'll pass hard on? Uh, once again, my stance is, I know that if you get 100 rookies to someone, it's not going to be as, uh, I guess, valuable or as desirable to when they're so common. But if Wiseman's a superstar, you'd want a card of Wiseman, right? If Halliburton's a superstar... Card to 25 is always nice. It's good to have a, just like a you know, a higher higher four, I'll say. Getting all those rookies, numbered vets, and you can't get any of the uh, less you know, desirable players that you would normally get from a Don Russ, from a Prism, something like that. So, scale from 1 to 10, I'm going to give this product, uh, once again, resales like 330. That might go down. I give it, I'm giving it an 8. An 8. I like it a lot. I think the only thing that really um, kind of is let down for me is the designs don't wow me. But overall, that four is going to be pretty nice. Uh, the ceiling is absolutely there. And um, it's just a fun thing to collect. Um, to get cards of all the top guys. To get cards of maybe Lamello. We've had a Lamello problem this year. No Lamellos or Ants. Guys like that. You'll have a chance to get some of those guys. So overall, a lot of fun. Really enjoyed it. And let me know your thoughts down below. And once again, enter the giveaway if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, if you pull anything from your boxes, let me know what you get. So that's for this one, guys. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.